Hello everybody, my name is Raging Raptor and I welcome you to another tank preview. Today with the IO-100 Japanese Tier 7 Heavy Tank. It has 1550 hit points and an engine with 1200 horsepower. With a weight of roughly 100 tons, it has a power to weight ratio of 11.89, which is actually not that bad. Still, the maximum speed is only 25 km forward and 10 km backward. The hull traverse is 20 degrees per second and the turret traverse is 18.8 degrees per second, which is super slow. The terrain resistance is for hard and medium grounds bad, for soft grounds better, with 1.1, 1.2 and 1.8. The fuel range of 380 meters is actually pretty good and the radio range no one cares about. Now we come to the most important part, the armor. The armor of this tank on the front is 175 millimeters on the hull, which is super strong. 70 millimeters on the side are actually pretty much weaker, but it doesn't matter, it's still enough to side scrap probably. The turret has 200mm in the front and 150 on the side. As you can see, this tank is super good armored. Johan can also see this, seriously, on these pictures where, where I show you the um, armor scheme. Excuse me, long waiting. To the gun, the gun gives you 330 damage and a penetration of 190 millimeters. In return, it has quite a bad round of fire with 5.74 shots per minute. It has a DPM of 1894 and a reload time of roughly 10.4 seconds. The accuracy of 0.38 is actually not that bad, but the aim time of 3 seconds is fairly bad. Still, the gun pressure of minus 10 and plus 12 is fairly good. And now to the conclusion, I have to say this tank is actually really good when it comes to armor. May most tier 7 tanks will have a huge amount of problems penetrating these beasts in the front. So guys, what do you think? Write it in the comments and don't forget to subscribe for the latest World of Tanks news. And as always, good luck on the battlefield.